I've always loved uh, biology and that's what I originally wanted to go into. And then I found out that it was the interactions between everything that really interests me. And I think resources science is getting right down into the basics of that. Every other course that I've taken, the labs have been not necessarily you doing your own work, but someone guiding you through it. And with these labs, I've found that they put you in front of it and you get to figure out what you're supposed to do. Uh, I was at home uh, watching Mythbusters uh, and they were digging a, a large pit in the ground. Uh, and my first thought was, oh, that's an interesting soil horizon. And I just thought, okay, if I'm thinking about that at home, I think I'm in the right spot. If you like working with your hands and you like seeing the fruits of your own labor, and you pr especially prefer being outside and with nature, then absolutely, this is a fantastic course. Uh, I like ecology, and so I like how uh, landscapes work and interact with, with one another and within themselves. Other people focus on toxicology, some focus on policy, some on the economic portion. It really varies based on your interests, and so I think that's a strength of it, is that you can turn out grads who can have really specific interests and strengths, but they also can do a little bit of everything, and that makes them really hireable. So I remember on the 301 field course, which is our main field course for the program, and it was pouring rain one day and about two degrees. And we have to hand texture soil to be able to tell what it is. And it was so cold that I couldn't feel my fingers. It was great fun. Some of the classes that you don't think are related at all are actually have the most impact on what you do here and after you're done as well. So just don't limit yourself. This program creates the dialogue of, okay, this is happening. Well, what do we do about it? and that's not present, I've found, in a lot of other environmental-based programs.